Assalamu alaikum and hi everyone. Today I'm going to be sharing my very special red pepper sauce which I use for all savouries that we have which are pies, samosas, spring rolls, anything, you name it. It actually goes well with it. So what you have, what I have here is just three red peppers cut up and I soaked it overnight in half a cup of vinegar. The next morning you're going to put this in a blender with the vinegar. The peppers would have softened quite nicely and that's exactly what you want. And then I'm just going to have this blended up with about six to eight red chilies. So I just took up the stems of them. You can add a bit more if you want but this is just the right amount that isn't as strong or spicy. So you're going to blend this up really well until it's nice and smooth. This sauce keeps for about six months or so in the fridge. I always make a well, I always make quite a bit. It comes out quite a bit from it. And once I have it bottled, I actually give it out to my family and friends. So in here, I have that's methi masala, sesame seeds, mustard seeds, and curry leaf. So in a pot, you're going to add a bit of oil. This is about, say about two tablespoons of oil. And you're going to add all of this in. The description box would have all the exact measurements. You're going to cook this just until it starts to sizzle a bit. So the methi seeds, uh, the methi masala and the mustard seeds are going to start sizzling. It takes just a few minutes, but watch them and don't let it burn. So it's nice and cooked right now. And if you smell this, you'll actually start smelling the fragrance of the curry leaves coming out. Once you reach the stage, this is where I'm just going to be adding in the red pepper mixture. And you're going to mix this and turn this on a low heat. Then I'm adding in one full bottle of this chili and garlic sauce. If you don't have the same type, you can use any chili sauce that you want. And a full bottle of tomato sauce. Now is when the sauce is coming nicely together and the smell is absolutely amazing. So I'm just adding some salt to taste, which is about maybe about a teaspoon and I'm adding some chili powder. You don't have to add this, this adds just a little bit of extra kick, but this isn't actually very spicy. It has some spice in it, but I promise you it's not overly empowered, empowering. So there you have it. This is the actual sauce. It's actually done. You're just going to leave it to just boil a little bit. And once it's all boiled, then you let it cool down and you can bottle it. Hope you enjoyed my recipe. Please try it and let me know what you think. Until next time. Bye. Salam.